Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. The other day, I posted on my Instagram, Father.Films, it's on the intro in the bottom left. You, you would have just saw it, yeah. I posted a photo doing a Q&A. I posted this photo, I'll put it on the screen. And I said, Instagram Q&A, ask me questions for my YouTube. So I got all together 40 questions. Some of them are like mess about, but I'm going to try and answer all of them. Depends what they are, if they're stupid or not. So, let's get right into it. So the first question is from Sam Partridge with two E's underscore. He said, why did I start scooters? So really why I started scooters is because in my videos like my websodes and one session, the first one, and some other videos, yeah, you would have known about Kim the Skype Park, which is a Skype Park just down the road from me. About a minute, right, literally. Probably shorter than that. But yeah, that was getting built about four years ago. I remember I went down on my roller skates. I had roller skates, not in lines like, you know, the ones before. I went I went down with them, on them. I found it way too hard to balance to, like, keep myself straight. And that was way too hard. And then I had a little JD Book Pro, a black one. Like, one with, like, you can move the bars and that. And I went down on that. And I don't know, it kind of just started there, really. So I went riding properly for a couple of years, yeah. But that's really how it started. So next question. So the next question I got is... Underscore dot Rowan with two ends. What's your best trick? This was a hard one because I can do quite a lot of tricks. Not not many, like not them that good really. But probably the best one I've landed. It's not amazing, but probably just a buttercup really. I got a few other tricks one foot, but like so I've actually landed a buttercup. So next one is from Josh underscore Hubble, which is like hub and then ball underscore o five. He asked me, who inspired you to start YouTube and favourite trick? Who inspired me? I don't really know. Like, I used to ride with Jack Burden a lot. JB Media Row 1, and he used to film videos, but he wasn't really, I don't know, I just, and like Ben Clark, I rode with him. But I just like, I just, I just wanted to start it. Yeah, like, if you didn't know, I had another channel called Fowler, Fowler Films, that was it, that was what it was called. I filmed that all on GoPro, the GoPro I use now, just the GoPro here, if you're wondering. And I know I enjoyed it, so I... I've spent a lot of money on this camera. And yeah, that's where it really started, really. I don't know if it really knows it's bothered me. My favourite trick, favourite trick all I can do is 270 bar of, of like a hip. This is because it feels, when you're doing it, it just feels really nice, really chilled. And I don't know, I just like doing that trick personally. But a favourite trick that like I can't do, that I like see people do is bar with front scooter. I love that trick, that's so nice. So yeah, that answers your question, Josh. Let's move on. Ben Walker two four two asked me favorite skate park apart from Unit. So Unit is my favorite skate park. He's right. But apart from that, it's Kimba. But I'm not gonna count that because like you probably already know that because I go there a lot and it's so close. So after them two, it's probably Rush. I've only been once and that one time I loved it. I did film a video if you haven't checked it out. Go check it out after this one. Next from Sam Troman's 04 underscore. What are my favourite riding shoes? I don't know if you ride, know, but I ride in Vans Old Schools. They're probably not actually my favourite riding shoes. Shoes, shoes. I just ride with them. I don't really know why. I just always have. And yeah, well, I rode with Nike SBs. They're my favourite. But I don't know. I just got Vans. But yeah, Nike SBs probably my favourite. Lightning underscore Ethan. I said, ever listen to Skate Punk? And in brackets, Sum 41, Blink 182, Newfound Glory. I've never heard of any of them or ever heard of it. Like, no, I don't even. Ethan goes to my school. So, I'm going to try it now. Should we see what it sounds like? Let's, let's have a go. This is the song. I've never heard this. Well, I just heard that first snippet. Oh my god. I just heard that first bit. It's not my type of music. Sorry, Ethan. Let's move on. Right, so the next question is from Finn with two ends dot Darby dot eleven. He was in my Instagram called the Shots. If you haven't seen that video, go check it out. It was two videos ago. Yeah, go watch that. 
But anyway, he said, how old was you when you got, how old was you when you got your first decent scooter? Plus videos are sick, keep up Billy. Thanks for the support. And um, yeah, my first decent scooter was a Mad Gear. End of days, I got the Ninja. Well, it wasn't the end of days, it was called the Ninja because it was all black. I got that. That was in 2013, so that was four years ago. So I'm 14 now. I would have been. I was 10 when I got my first decent scooter. It is the one on the far. This side. I don't know what side it is for you. This side here. That black one. But that was, that was, that was my first. My first proper decent scooter. There you go, Finn. Callum Dot Evans with three S's, Rainbow Toe. Ask me, what's your dream sponsor, dream trick, and favourite rider, and why? For all of them. So, my dream sponsor is probably probably Apex, just because their parts are just all the parts are just sick. I hopefully should be getting some Apex bars next month. Tell me in the cards. The cards is up there. Whether I should get gold, blue, black, or red. I'll put them in the cards. Touch vote on which one. Right, and favourite rider, I think now. No, dream trick. Dream trick is my dream trick's probably a cash roll. Probably a cash roll. They're just so sick. I love cash rolls, they look so cool. Don't really mind fast but or not, whatever. My favourite rider. Favourite rider, Dylan Morrison. Dylan Morrison is just hilarious. He's so funny. If you haven't watched his YouTube, it's so funny. And he's sick. He's so good. So Ben underscore Thomas underscore 07. He goes to my school, he's in my form. He asked me, what is your funniest moment in your life? Explain story. If you know me, I laugh a lot. I've laughed, I can't even remember the funniest one, but one of the funniest in like, scooter room related was at the skate park. In the summer, this summer, Alec Taylor. I don't know if you're watching my videos, but Alec Taylor. Trying to double up the drive like Kimber. I'll put in a clip now. I feel so bad for Zane because he actually owned himself, but that was such a funny day and funny thing to film. On, oh, that's one of the funniest I have laughed. I'll probably laugh more, but I can't remember. They're normally just stupid things. But yeah, next question. Ben has scored Dot Thomas. He's a normal one goes to my school, different person. Cash me outside. How about that? Dead meme. Callum BMX Woody. That's his Instagram. He said, would you ride BMX? I've rode a BMX lot before, I can like 180, really, that's it, like, yeah, you know, yeah. Just, what, the basic basics. I don't know, I would. But I'm kind of small and not very, like, strong. I'm not, yeah, yeah, I'm not strong at all. So I don't know, I don't think BMX is really my thing, but I'm not, you, you never know, do you? Yeah. Libby underscore my two four one. Why do I scoot? Kind of why I scoot is because of one of the first questions about why I started scootering. Because of Kimber Skate Park. That really like, that's where it all started. I, I never went any further because obviously unit wasn't open and there's no really good skate parks around here. So I just rode Kimber for two years and learned a lot of my stuff on that. But Harley's underscore media asked, What do you edit on? Favourite trick? What do you do YouTube? Favourite rider? If you couldn't scoot, what, what would you want to achieve? So I've answered the middle three. So what do I edit on? I edit on Sony Platinum. It's like Sony Vegas, but it's Movie Studio Platinum 12.0. So it looks like this. So this was a game of swap that went up before this video. That hopefully you would have seen if you haven't watched this video and go watch that with Josh. Yeah, but after it's all done and that, this is what it looks like. This is what my editing software looks like. Yeah. It's kind of weird to get used to, but you get used to it after a bit. Shout out to James Bird. He gave me this because he's a legend. Go subscribe to him. It's James Bird. H.Moylan1. How long have you been riding? So, four years ago. But properly riding. Properly riding about mm, three years ago. DJ Miller09. Millerino. Why Harrison Dines' teeth are so big? I don't have a clue either. Keegan, <laughs> here we go. McLaughlin underscore underscore. 
How do you break your arm and balls as I'm done? I'll ask you the same thing, mate. <laughs> Chaz Media asked, how long does it take to edit a video? Like a probably about two and a half hours, but then like a video like this, probably about two hours. So yeah, but then like an edited video, probably about three hours, because there's a lot to do. You have to sync it all up, and that takes a long time. Josh Cars underscore 11, the best skew rider you've met. The best one I've seen, I saw Kota, Scoot Fest. 2016, the last one. I saw him there. The best one I've actually spoke to him in like Billy Watts. He came to unit a few years ago, well, about a year ago. And yeah, yeah. Underscore Max. Faraday, who is your favourite rider in the USA? Probably Raymond Warner, because he's got a different style to most of like pop people. He goes B and I like Raymond Warner and his videos are sick. Ollie Bailey's underscore 13. Why did you start YouTube and when? I've already answered why. And when? I started it. My first video, I think, was in June 2016. Underscore Jack Jones.03 asked, How you bossed your teeth? He didn't know them two are chipped. Yeah, them two are chipped. Pretty messed up. They're still hurting. And yeah, I'm just going to explain. Yeah, it's going to be quite long. So I was in year three. First time I did it, that to the fair on the right. That one. I was on the playground. Got run into, hit the floor, cut on my mouth. Chip that tough a little bit though, just a little bit half of it, like half of it going that way. And then I got kept getting that field and kept getting that field and had it done like loads. And then I um I came off my scooter on that mad ninja. I don't know when. And that's how and that's how if you've ever noticed this lump on my lip there. That's how I did that. I actually bit from my lip. I've got a scar on the top. But I didn't do anything to my teeth then. I just kept I just chipped it. Kept getting filled in, kept getting filled in. Quite recently, last year, I think it was in summer. August time. I, Akimba, did a double down whip, oh, like over coping, that ramps about five and a half foot, over coping, and I missed the catch. So it came round and said, This is the deck, and there's my foot, my foot just missed it. And I'm a duck two feet landed like that, and said, This block there, my feet, and this done my head. I landed on my feet, then my knees, and my fingies, and my, like, my hands, grinded my hands on the concrete, and went, Dung, so all the impact went into my face. I um I'm not the rest of this one out, so this one's just half now. And I clean not this one half. The actual adult tooth. They're both adult teeth. And from there, it all went downhill. So I got them filled in, kept getting them filled in, just kept breaking. Had an apple and they broke, but they weren't really hurting. And then about a month ago, over a bit over a month, I was at uni on a Tuesday night. I did a 180 onto the driveway, full cab off to Fakie, so that's a 180, 360 into the bank that carried on Fakie. I did more than three, slipped out, came on and wiped my face off the floor again. I have like these ulcers on top of my teeth and they kill at points. I've been on like tablets a lot and they are a lot. So yeah, my teeth are pretty messed up. But I've never broke anything else. That was it. That's definitely, yeah. There you go, Jake. So that really positive, nice note is going to end the video. If you enjoyed, please like and subscribe. Let's go for 40 likes on this one. We've got 400 subscribers, so 40 likes. Thank you guys for watching and peace.